Our whole universe was in a hot, dense state that nearly 14 billion years ago expansion started. Wait, the earth began to cool, the autotrophs began to drool, Neanderthals developed tools, we built a wall. We built the pyramids, math, science, history, unraveling the mystery that all started with a big bang.
actually like the um, ISSI program. Like, we got to do science, but also, like, after that, there's, like, lots of fun we got to do, and, like, the buildings are, like, amazing to climb, and, I mean, just always put ping pong. But, like, the science part is awesome, too, because you get to experience, like, you know, like, the real laboratory work. And, um, yeah, and then you write a report, and, like, I mean, it's a short report, but it's, like, a taste of, like, the real becoming a real scientist and I really like that. I've really enjoyed being part of the uh, ISSI program. Um, I've had a chance to meet loads of different people from all over the world and different cultures. Um, I've been working in the physics department and everyone there has been really great. Um, I was with Avner, he's from Israel, and uh, yeah, it, being able to see some cutting-edge research that you wouldn't be able to see anywhere else in the world has just been fantastic and uh, I'll definitely take this away um, with me, everything. Um, yeah, it's been really good. I, I feel very lucky to have come to this program because I've known people from many cultures and I've also uh, had the opportunity to know more about this country as well and its culture and I think it's very interesting and also people who have the same interests in, as me and uh, well, people who try to be my opponent at ping pong but they don't achieve. Being part of the SEMI camp has been an amazing opportunity. I met so many people from all over the world. I'm working in an amazing lab. And the most important thing is the friendship that I wish to keep there forever. Um, I really enjoyed ISSI because I think that I had great opportunities in the lab to explore physics, which I was ne be never able to do before. And I made a lot of new friends from all over the world. Like David, I had new opportunities. For example, I learned how to use NMR and did a really cool project investigating uh, the potential to create new drugs for, to treat HIV. I said I got to do chemistry research for the first time, which is exciting because I want to be a chemist. It's like interesting to see what people really do because I feel like you never actually know what like the career you want to do, like what those people actually do until you try it. So. It was exciting to get the opportunity to try it, and I had like such an amazing time in my lab. I had like a fantastic mentor, and like just the other grad students in the lab were like so nice, and we had like a lot of fun. And I just, I loved like the. <laughs> That's so sweet. <laughs> I, I love I love like the like lab work environment because it's so it's like so casual. People are just like, it's it's fun. You're having fun. <laughs> We love the program. It's been great. We've made so many good friends. Hey, Gabby. Yay, um, I actually love the food. Falafel <laughs> is the best. And Charlie's? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And I love my lab partner. She's the absolute <laughs> best. I love my lab partner. She's the best. <laughs> Yay! It's been a nice experience. Quite nice. We had a really great time. Although it was very, very hot and the bugs were You're horrible. from here. Yeah, it's not that hot in Yerucham. <laughs> it's like hot, it's, but it's not humid. Yerucham is in the middle of the desert. <laughs> well, it's easier because it's more dry there. Oh yeah, yeah it's today particularly is really humid. Yeah, yeah, it is. It's horrible. How do they live here in Israel? I don't understand. <laughs> I just don't get it. I love it. Also, the cockroaches. Oh, my the God. cockroaches are horrible. <laughs> That's only for her. She, only for me. They just has, love me. They just love me, yeah. And yeah. she doesn't kill them. I don't that's, kill I them. I think that's the problem. She doesn't kill them. You're that's so why they love her. If you kill them, you're like... And then when you think they're dead, you hit them again. And then you, you throw people. them outside. Cruel people. Cruel people. You can't kill them. He has people, a soul. Why don't you put He's a leash on him? He has and kids. He has a pet. He has kids. And mother. And father. And brothers. And Cockroach scientist! We're killing their best brains.